The following is a video tutorial by Jerry McLaughlin for WND.com. Looks to me like we're headed for an old-fashioned showdown. You in there, Barack? Eric Holder and the U.S. Justice Department have targeted Sheriff Joe Arpaio. You know Joe, the toughest sheriff in America. He's a hero to the folks back home in Maricopa County, Arizona, and across the U.S. of A. He wears the white hat, and he don't cotton to corruption, even if he has to follow the trail all the way to the White House. Seems Sheriff Joe ruffled some feathers back east when he pledged to exhume some long-buried records. He dares to challenge the legality of Obama and the gang, staking their claim to four more years of squatters' rights at 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. You see, this bunch in the Justice Department, they got it all reversed. To them, enforcing the Constitution is a criminal act. But giving thousands of guns to drug cartels in Mexico to kill U.S. Border Control agents, well, to them, that's a good thing. So they got mad, rounded up some federal henchmen, and told them to go strip Sheriff Joe's deputies of all their immigration badges. Bad move, hombre, because this has just riled up millions of Sheriff Joe's friends across the heartland of America. They know treason when they smell it. Bad Barack, evil Eric, and their gang have left our southern defenses sagging and our local manpower lagging. Ninety-two deputies now powerless to nab those bad hombres at the Mexican border. And all thanks to the criminal suspects in the White House. But when Sheriff Joe steps out into the street, he don't have to go it alone. There's still time for you to join the Arpaio Posse and ride the Sheriff Joe's defense. Show him you've got his back and stand up for America. Visit Sheriff Joe's website at SheriffJoe.org and see what you can do to help. That's SheriffJoe.org. This is one showdown we can't afford to lose.